Hey tribe, hey, welcome back to my channel, Presence of a Goddess. Thank you guys for joining me today. Today's just going to be a quick message for the tribe. So if it resonates, awesome. Appreciate if you subscribe, like, share those you think it resonate too. I do appreciate you. Any other information you need to know is down below. Sending you up a love, peace, and blessings. Alright guys, so what I was channeling was your matching energy or... <laughs> For some of you guys, you're not even matching energy. Like, your energy is up here and somebody can't reach you. It's really giving, okay? They're trying to poke the beast or they're trying to get in your energy. And it's just they no excess, all right? Somebody is, like, really trying their best. Somebody's getting tired of this. I'm also getting sugar babies. Sugar babies could be very significant, all right? Somebody could be brown skin. Some about caramel. Okay, leche, somebody could drink like a, somebody could be Spanish, something about milk, chocolate milk. Okay, it's a lot of food in here. Okay? <laughs> I don't know if you just like, you're eating, you're eating good. I don't know. Something about, um, or you have a sweet tooth. You could have a sweet tooth right now. Okay, somebody wants you to be their baby. Okay, uh, you could be a sugar baby for real, for real. Or um, somebody wants to spoil you. Or the universe is spoiling you. Um, I'm getting back to that magic energy part. So something happened where somebody's upset because you're giving them the same energy that they gave you. The cold shoulder. For some of you guys, this could be the cold shoulder. Some of you guys, this could be you simply just taking back your energy. And they see that as a slap in the face. Okay. That's what it's giving. Okay. Our home situation is going to improve. Okay. Some of you guys, you could have lived with this person, or you're getting your home in order, all right? Some of you guys are um, Virgos. You could be getting your health in order. This could just be your temple, or you need like to do a cleanse. If you're craving a lot of sugar, it may be like you have too much, like it, you need a cleanse. Yeah, four of cups here. You're not paying somebody no mind. Somebody could be a cancer. Some of you guys stop drinking, or you stop drinking a lot. Some of you guys, you changing your car to a more gas efficient car. Yeah, the moon. There's something about the moon here. The new moon was on the 10th. The new moon in Pisces. Something didn't work. Somebody tried to do something on the new moon against you. It didn't work. Your prayers are being answered about a prayer or a petition you had in the new moon. And as you know, you can always get prepared for the new moon three days before or three days after. Okay. Your intuition was telling you something. Somebody wanted you to ignore your intuition, to cleanse your space, to cleanse your energy. But you you paid attention. You're on top of things when it comes to cleansing your spirit, okay? For some reason, for some of you guys, the new moon in Pisces was very powerful for you. You could be a Pisces, or you have a lot of Neptune, or you're just tapped in spiritually. You already made the sacrifices you needed to make. So you are ready for this new moon. This is the last new moon until springtime. So this could be significant. As y'all know, springtime is the, the actual um, New Year's. So you have ended a cycle. And now you're starting a new cycle for this new year. Somebody has like big curly hair. Somebody could be 4C. You could be embracing your natural hair. Okay, somebody got bushy eyebrows. Somebody could be an Aquarius. You could have blocked some people off of your Facebook. I don't know why I just said so. Maybe Facebook could be very significant. You had a lot of people watching you. They thought they were hiding, but you knew. Like, they think they're low. Like, why do you think you low? You think somebody's stupid? <laughs> okay, somebody didn't want you to see something. You had a devil here. The devil did not want you to see something. The devil wanted to play in your face. Yeah. Somebody was conjuring up a demonic spirit and it backfired. Yeah. <sighs> you get a new beginning, like I said. All right. Somebody name could start with an O, first, minute, or last. Something about hats. Somebody likes to wear hats a lot. Or you have different hats, like different talents, different skills. You are a shapeshifter, but you use your shapeshifting for good. All right, somebody used their 
somebody used their skills and their talents for evil and now it's starting to um, backfire on you it could be a Lilith like Lilith energy like somebody's in their low low shadow Kelly Ma could be in here helping you get karma all right somebody somebody is a woman but they look like a masculine somebody has a very masculine face okay somebody looks demonic in the face you can tell all right because you have that gift you can of discernment you have that gift of discernment this is how you know how you can cleanse your energy because you can tell when somebody's doing something so somebody thought they were on the low but you can see the demonic spirit in them yeah Okay, your crown chakra is open. You can see right through something. Somebody was trying to um, cloud your judgment or uh, hide, cloak behind something, playing mind games. It didn't work, all right? It didn't work the way they thought it would work. Actually, I'm being guided to use this. So. Yeah, somebody shattered, okay? Are their plans shattered? wishful thinking because you're getting what you what you desire because you stood by yourself that's what i'm hearing like you went into isolation mode to manifest somebody expected you to um to go somewhere or to hang with some people during the new moon somebody also could have been trying to, to attack your dreams they thought they were freddy krueger <laughs> somebody likes to attack people's dreams because this is how this person, this person is like a dream stealer or a dream thief or a, like a nightmares, okay? Somebody likes to send nightmares to you, but you're too healed, so it doesn't work. It, it, it can't bother you. You know how to astral project? You could definitely be a Pisces or have a lot of Neptune. You know how to astral project, so they can't touch you because you healed your inner child or you're healing your inner child. You know, we all healing. It's, it's endless here, but nurturing. The key to healing, I'm hearing, is to be honest with yourself, be real with yourself. That's the first key. Like they say in AAA or AA, whatever <laughs> they say, you know, first admitting that you have a problem. So admitting to your problems, that's how you're healing. Okay. Yeah, somebody want that's why somebody was trying to block your crown chakra so you wouldn't see what you needed to heal. All right. But you nurtured. You're nurturing yourself. This could even be you have mother or father issues. Okay. But fourth house is mother. Okay. So, yeah, you could have mother issues and you learn how to mother yourself or become a better mother, even if you didn't have that example in your life. For some of you guys, your grandmother raised you. All right. Some of you guys, you get your gift from your grandmother. All right. Soulmate. You're about to, your soulmate is about to come running to you. Your soulmate is running to you. You see packing. They're packing their things and they're coming to you. Yeah, because they burning bridges with toxicity as well. Yeah, you and your soulmate is in alignment. I keep getting that. Because it's too much tension. Or your energy is too sensitive right now. That you can't just have a good time. You need something long term. And your soulmate as well. Maybe your soulmate was playing games or was running away from a soulmate connection. Even if you don't know this person. They was running away from a commitment. But now they're giving up on that. Because um, like giving up on running or playing games because it's too much you know they're suffering in silence but this could also be uh somebody thought you, you're getting the last laugh somebody is suffering in silence while you are laughing okay they were afraid of this that you will um enjoy life again somebody wear dark red lipstick or maroon somebody likes red okay some of you guys somebody was peeking in your door or was spying on you through cameras or something like that or trying to hack into your stuff yeah they're getting tired of this here they're just like why why is tribe not like tired why are they not going through bad stuff i sent all these demons to them yeah they're about to get a spiritual ass whooping. okay they for, they didn't know who you were you didn't know who you were but you're definitely a powerful being in the spiritual realm all right you know how to astral project you when you sleep you go to different rooms all right i'm also hearing nine if there's Yes, it's complicated or it's too complicated to try to send you bad vibrations because you're receiving a lot of love and support from your ancestors and you're not from here. You're from a different planet. Like I said, now somebody's waking up to this. Something could be, something is being unplugged, okay? Something cannot work no more. They cannot get in your energy anymore. This is why 
I feel like you can't match their energy because your energy is too high. But in their minds, they think you are matching energy because you're not showing them, like you're not paying them no mind. But they're paying you mind. So how are you matching energy if you paying them mind? That don't make no sense. They're obsessed with you. You're not obsessed with them. Somebody's delusional. Somebody's like not seeing. That's why it's complicated for them because they're, they're making it complicated. All right? They're not... They don't have logic. The way they're thinking, their logic is really twisted here, okay? Maybe they're believing their lies too much, okay? Yeah, you're from a different planet. Spirit wants you to know that. You don't need no filters. Somebody could be saying you put filters in your photos or something. You don't need no filter. You're a star, okay? Yeah, you're receiving a lot of love, support. It was complicated for them because you're wifey type. And that's why your soulmate's coming towards you with the ring, okay? Friday could be significant or something about your Venus, all right? You're very loved by everybody, all right? Because you exude love. Love is in you and on you, baby, okay? Yeah, you have superpowers. Somebody, your superpowers are activated because you learn how to raise your vibration and to heal or to keep it real with yourself. Yeah, you did your homework on how to protect your energy, all right? Somebody was doing homework. They need to take notes because, baby, somebody's trying to figure out how are you doing something? How are you protecting your energy? How are you still elevating? And I'm throwing these demons at you. Because you did your homework, okay? You face your shadow, you face your shadow self. Alright? That's why you're free from this demonic spirit. Somebody's birthday could be coming up here. Somebody could be an Aries or a Pisces. Yeah, they have to stop because you're glittering, baby. Now they have to stop. This is who I am. Nobody said you had to like it. Period. <laughs> They, they really wanted you to be somebody that you weren't. And this is why they're all twisted and confused. Because they confused themselves about who you were. And they made it complicated on themselves. You told them who you were. You kept it real with yourself. You kept it real with them. They didn't like that. So they wanted you to be something else. All right? But the truth is in the pudding. Okay? The proof is in the pudding here. You're powerful. You're not from here. You already told them, don't F with me. And they got the right one. And now they think you're matching energy, baby. No. It's getting sent back to sender. That's what it is. What you're trying to project on me is getting sent back to you. And you don't like that feeling. Excuse the noise, y'all. Y'all already know how it go. People want to be in all in my video. Like, <laughs> baby, I'm the star. You're not. So somebody's starting to realize you're the star, they're not, and they're steady trying to get trying to get in your energy. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, you're harmonized. Somebody's a Libra. You're balanced. You're at peace with whatever happened. Somebody wants you to be upset so bad. No. I'm good, baby. I forgive you. You know what I'm saying? Stay the F away from me. You keep trying it. You keep getting your own feelings hurt. Yeah, because they're two-faced. Yeah, real recognized real and you're not looking real familiar. Period. All right, okay, let me see if I can get y'all some letters here. All right, y'all, let me get y'all some letters out and just just, just ignore the noise, y'all, because I don't feel like stopping this video today. So my name start with an F here. Fifi could be significant, all right? Fee could be significant. Somebody could try to steal your man. Chinese could be significant. Peck, peck, somebody name could be peck. Some pecking birds could be pecking, something like that here. All right, like I said, they try to poke the beast. All right, somebody name could be Cedric, Justinia, Netta, Nito, Tony, Tone, Tony, Tony, Tone could be significant. Q, somebody name could be Q. All right, Toe, something about Toes. All right, Kawana, Gucci, Gucci, all right, Prada. <laughs> Mino, Mano, T Tony keeps coming out to me. All right, Peg, 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 um, Cracker Bell, Cracker Bell could be significant. Nito, Nato, somebody sings. Okay, Cartoon Network could be significant. C M first or last, or North Carolina could be significant. Cincinnati. Okay, I hope this resonates.